Hello, and welcome back to our Kids See What World podcast. Today we are going to learn about the 12 spies in promised land from Numbers 1 and 3. God led the Israelites out of Egypt to a special place called the promised land. To prepare, God told Moses to send 12 spies to explore the land. The spies explored the land for 40 days. They saw it was amazing with plenty of food and huge fruits. They even brought back a giant cluster of grapes. But when the spies returned, ten of them were scared and said, The land is great, but the people there are giants. We can't fight them. Two of the spies, Joshua and Caleb, said, Yes, the land is wonderful, and the people are so big and strong, but we can't take it. God is with us. Do not be afraid. Sadly, the Israelites listened to the ten fearful spies. The people got scared, complained and forgot that God had promised to give them this land. God was disappointed that they didn't trust him. Because of their lack of faith, they had to wander in the wilderness for 40 more years. Only Joshua and Caleb, who trusted God, were finally allowed to enter the promised land. So what can we learn from this passage? Trusting God's promise. Just like God promised the Israelites the land, he makes promises to us too. We can find his promise in the Bible. When God makes a promise, he always keeps it. Remember that God is faithful to his word. Don't be afraid. It's easy to get scared when we see big problems like the giants the Israelites saw. But we need to remember that God is bigger and stronger than any problem. When we are afraid, we can pray and put our trust in God. Walk by faith, not by sight. The ten spies saw the giants and felt afraid. Joshua and Caleb saw the giants too, but they had faith in God's promise. Hebrews 11 verse 1 says, Now faith is the assurance of what we hope for, and the certainty of what we do not see. Encourage others. Joshua and Caleb tried to encourage the Israelites to trust God. We can do the same for our friends and family. When someone is scared or worried, we can remind them of God's promise and help them to trust them. Let's sing a song to help us learn Hebrews 11 verse 1 to 3. Now faith is the assurance of what we hope for And the certainty of what we do not see This is why the ancients were commanded By faith we understand that the universe was formed at God's command So that what is seen was not made out of what was visible Hebrews 11 verse 1 to 3 Hebrews 11 verse 1 to 3 Now faith is the assurance of what we hope for And the certainty of what we do not see This is why the ancients were commended By faith we understand That the universe was formed so that what is seen was not made out of what was visible. Hebrews 11, verse 1 to 3. Hebrews 11, verse 1 to 3. Let's pray to finish. Dear God, thank you for your promises. Help us to trust you like Joshua and Caleb did. Give us courage knowing that you are bigger than any problem. Thank you for loving us and taking care of us. In Jesus' name, Amen. That's all for today's devotional. I look forward to joining you again for the next one. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe.